Nysora videos. In this video, we will briefly describe the infraclavicular and pec blocks Nysora simulator. To begin practicing, the simulator is first taken out of its custom-made box onto its custom-made tray. Clear labeling is provided on the tray that indicates where the simulator belongs on the human body. Instructions for use and care are also provided, as well as descriptions of the abbreviations used in the ultrasound image. The infraclavicular and pec block simulator features realistic surface anatomy. Here, we can see the delta pectoral groove and clavicle. To begin practicing, a liberal amount of ultrasound gel is applied. Before sonographing, it is important to increase the ultrasound gain because of the difference in the simulator material and human tissue. In the ultrasound image, we see the pectoralis major muscle, pectoralis minor muscle, fascia of the pectoralis minor muscle, the axillary artery and vein, and the three cords of the brachial plexus. In this case, the needle is inserted in plane and directed through the pectoralis major muscle, pectoralis minor muscle, underneath the pectoralis minor fascia, where the injection of local anesthetic is performed underneath the axillary artery. Additional instructions on how to perform the pec block are provided in the insert that accompanies the simulator, as well as on medexpress.pro.